Understanding Spider Mite, an English language learning guide. Hello everyone. Today, we're going to explore a unique phrase in the English language, spider mite. This term may sound a bit unusual, but it's quite interesting when you break it down. So, let's dive in and learn all about spider mites and how this term is used in English. Spider mites are tiny creatures, often considered pests, that belong to the class Arachnida. They are closely related to spiders, which is why spider is part of their name. These mites are incredibly small, often requiring a microscope to be seen clearly. They are known for living on plants and causing damage by feeding on the plant's sap. This section of our video will showcase close-up images of spider mites and the effects they have on plants. The phrase, spider mite, is not just limited to biology or gardening. It can also be used metaphorically in everyday language. For example, someone might say, this problem is like a spider mite. It's small but causes a lot of damage. This metaphorical use emphasizes small problems causing significant impact, drawing a parallel with how tiny spider mites can harm plants. We'll include some common sentences using spider mite metaphorically to help you understand this usage better. Sometimes, spider mite is mistaken for a type of spider or an insect. It's important to know that spider mites are neither. They are a type of mite, which is different from insects and spiders, although they share some similarities. In this section, we'll clear up these misconceptions and also look at how spider mites are referenced in various cultures, such as in literature or popular media. We hope this video has helped you understand what spider mite means and how it's used in the English language. Whether you're a gardening enthusiast or just curious about new phrases, knowing about spider mites adds an interesting layer to your English vocabulary. Remember, language learning is an exciting journey, and each new phrase you learn is a step forward. Happy learning, and see you in our next video!